This segment of DoD TV is brought to you by Cold Steel. Anytime, anywhere. You know, these Rogue Ridge bikes are a game changer. You not only is this bike in an indispensable tool during the season, getting to stands and out of stands very quietly, scent free, checking cameras, but pre-season, getting minerals out, getting those cameras out, checking new spots, as well as post-season in, in scouting, shed hunting. It's just been an indispensable tool. You know, when we're filming our hunts, we have a lot of gear that we have to haul in and out. You know, with these Rogue Ridge bikes, we can get to the far reaches of this property safely, quietly, and scent free. We stow those bikes, I cover them with a netting, and uh, we're in a tree well before daylight, not sweated up. You know, conversely, when it's time to get out of the stand, we haul that gear just to our bikes, and we're out of here. You know, I'll be 58, I'm not getting any younger, but to me, exercise is still very important. And with these bikes, they're pedal assist. I love that because I can still get the exercise, but when I want that bike to do the work and I'm not getting sweated up, you know, I let it do the work. You know, when it comes to the batteries on these bikes, I really have been impressed with this RM750. Now, I don't leave my bike over here in Ohio where I'm doing primarily most of my hunting. I'll bring it over, I'll run it, whether it's really cold or not. How far I go doesn't seem to matter. I get back out. That bike, by the time I get home, is still 90% plus charged. You'll love this bike for hauling gear. When I'm hunting, you know, whether I'm turkey hunting, I throw that shotgun on the front, decoys on the back. When I'm bow hunting, I put the bow on my back, strap my pack to the back of that bike, and very quickly and quietly, I can get into a setup and do that without getting sweated up. Whether it's early season, it's really hot, or when it's really cold, I can wear all my gear and ride that bike right to the blinder stand and not get sweated up and not waste time once I get to the stand because I'm ready to go. You know, these bikes come with a number of accessories that you can purchase. A cart's probably the biggest one, hauling in minerals, corn to feeders, you know, a lot of gear in and out. And hey, if you got the right ground, you could probably even take a deer out on one. I haven't done that yet. Maybe that's the next Rogue Ridge adventure that I'm looking for. One of the best things about these Rogue Ridge bikes, you know, they weigh about 65 or 70 pounds versus taking a four wheeler to and from your hunting area. It just is a pain. For the bikes, I just throw it right in the back of my truck, hook it up, a few minutes, I'm gone. It's easy, it's simple, it's quick, and it's less expensive. You'll love the bikes, whether it's pre-season, during season, or post-season. Temperatures are gonna be dropping. Perfect conditions for the skinny field. Gotta focus on those afternoon hunts. Northwest Tree Stand, 5 p.m. It's the easiest decision you'll make this season. Get ahead of your game with DeerCast. We're adding new videos every week, so make sure to click that subscribe button and check out all of our amazing content. This episode of DoD TV was brought to you by Leopold.